How to see who's using your Wi-Fi and block them permanently. Is your internet suddenly slow? Someone could be stealing your Wi-Fi. Today, I'll show you how to catch them. Fast, easy, and no tech skills needed. If someone sneaks onto your network, they can use up your data, spy on your browsing, steal personal information, and even trace your online transactions. Worst of all, they could do illegal activities like downloading pirated content or hacking, using your IP address. That means you could get blamed. So now that you know the risks, don't trust anyone on your network. First, I'll show you how to find out who's connected to your Wi-Fi. Then, I'll show you a real method to kick them out, permanently. Let's get started. Using the router method. Every router has an IP address. First, open a browser and type your router's IP address. You'll need your login details. If you haven't changed them, try admin and admin as username and password, respectively. That's the default for most routers. Once inside, look for a section like device list, connected devices, or DHCP clients, depending on your router model. Mine has devices tab at the top here. I will just click on it, and this shows me every device using connected to my Wi-Fi and using my internet. If you see a name you don't recognize, like a random phone or laptop, it's likely an intruder. You can filter the devices currently online and using your Wi-Fi and those that are offline at the moment. All right, keep this window intact. We will come back a few minutes. So let's move to method two on how to reveal people using your Wi-Fi by using a phone app. If the router method is too complicated, use free apps like Fing or Who's on My Wi-Fi. These apps scan your network and show all connected devices with names and IP addresses. They're available on the app stores, so go ahead and install your preferred one. I have both apps, but I will use Fing. Open the app and tap on See Devices button. This will show you all the devices connected to your Wi-Fi currently. Tap on the device, and that's going to reveal more details about it, including the device IP address and MAC address. Alright, now that you know who's connected, here's how to kick them off. Fing and similar apps can show you the option to remove, block, or pause devices. But these are premium features, and you may have to pay. Now on Fing, tap on the device, then scroll down. Here you have the options to pause the internet for the device, remove and block it. However, to be honest with you, this method isn't always effective. Why? Because if someone already has your password, they can simply reconnect manually, even after you block them. Removing devices from apps is not reliable. Don't fall for those videos saying it's enough. Instead, the real way is through your router. So let's go back to your router dashboard. You remember I asked you to keep intact. If you lost the page, don't worry. You can still log in using IP address and password. Find the unwanted device and click block, blacklist, or disable, depending on your router model. Some routers even let you allow only approved devices using MAC address filtering. Every device that is connected to your Wi-Fi has a MAC address. We can use this to block and remove the device from using our internet. All right, find Wi-Fi MAC filter wherever it is in your settings. Mine is in the Advanced tab, so I will click on it. On the left panel, select Wi-Fi MAC filter. Then turn the slider to the right to activate it. On the Filter mode, select Block. Now, you have the Wi-Fi MAC address list. Under it, you have the device name, MAC address, and options. Click on the Addition icon here. This opens a new window to add a device you want to block. On Device Name, Click on the down pointing arrow and you will see all the devices connected to your Wi-Fi, both online and offline devices. Select the one you want to block. I have a lot of them. I will select a device named iPhone. It will automatically fill in the device MAC address. So click OK to finish. Now click on Save to block the device. And that's it. This device is blocked permanently from being able to connect to your Wi-Fi even if they have your password. To unblock the device, if you want it to connect to your Wi-Fi again, click on the delete icon here, then click on save. All right, the second reliable method is to two. Finally, change your Wi-Fi password. To do that, click on Wi-Fi settings tab on the top here. You can change the Wi-Fi name and password here. On Wi-Fi name, rename your Wi-Fi to something unique, so it's harder for them to guess. On Wi-Fi password, choose a strong one. Use combination of letters, numbers, and special characters. 
On security mode, make sure your router is using WPA2 or WPA3 encryption. Never select WEP. It's outdated and insecure. All right, now you know how to catch Wi-Fi thieves, block them, and secure your network. If this helped you, give it a thumbs up, share with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more tech and internet tips. Got questions? Drop them in the comments. I'll help you out.